Hey guys, this is Daimon I'm bringing you the latest news and reviews, either about mods or games. And this time I was told by Steam this afternoon that one of my favorite games of the last few months had a DLC. It was only 5 bucks, so I bought it and this turned out to be a mistake. Don't get me wrong guys, I really love Shadows Awakening. I finished the game pumped about 20 plus hours into it and I had a blast playing it. So some more DLCs are always a welcome addition and I would gladly pay them and also pay for them to support the developers. And yes, lately the devs have been pushing out some free content. And yes, we probably shouldn't be complaining about any of this and yes, we're talking about 5 bucks. But still, I just felt wrapped off. Because these 5 bucks for less than 30 minutes of gameplay, that's just a problem. Let's read the DLC description while you're looking at my stream from this afternoon. Shadows Awakening, the Chromaton Chronicles, leads you to the northern edge of Toll. There lies the mysterious Arcanum Laboratory, a long since abandoned place known for its ruthless and immoral magical experiments. One of those experiments conducted by the Tholian mages involved the baneful energy named Chromaton. It is believed that it has the power to bring inanimate metal to life, but the mages failed to consider the dangers in bringing the unrefined essence into contact with their own living flesh. Perhaps they succeeded, perhaps they failed miserably. The outcome has never been chronicled, until now. Features The Tholian Arcanum Enter the Arcanum Laboratory, a new place that is challenging you to solve puzzles, complete quests and gather intel about the remnants of the contested experiments executed in the latter days of Thol. Unleash the tortured spirits of the Tholian mages and follow their trail to the shadows to finally unveil their sinister intentions. Living Metal Assemble the missing pieces of the chromaton heart and breathe life into the chromaton golem's metallic flesh. A powerful old new puppet with devastating skills. And last but not least, a new life. Start from scratch once again and acquire the chromaton golem soul or head back to Thol with your existing soul companions to add this puppet to your party. Now guys, this sounds good. I thought so at least. However, it turns out that all these three new features are actually the exact same thing. Some spoilers ahead, but let's discuss these features. The Tholian Arcanum is a really small place in Thol, where you will find one puzzle with levers and basically one quest, which is to find four pieces of a golem. It's a level 4 quest by the way, and each piece is a subquest. Living Metal, the second feature, are those subquests with the four pieces. And those pieces can be found really fast by slaying some spirits, because they're all close to the Arcanum or even in the Arcanum itself. And then you assemble the golem, he will be a new puppet, and that's it. A new life, the third feature, basically refers to the same thing again, telling you you'll be getting a puppet. Oh yeah, and you can start a new playthrough, but I can also start a new playthrough without this DLC of course. My main issue here is that this description deceives us as gamers with three features that are really just a single quest. If I'm missing content here, I will apologize in a later video, but I completed this whole thing in less than 30 minutes and I found myself asking, where's the rest of this DLC? I looked around for another hour fed some pumpkin monsters some candy, but I'm afraid that this is really just it. Let me know in the comments if I'm missing something or if you have maybe similar experiences. Because guys and girls do not buy this for even 5 bucks, it is simply not worth it, regardless of how much I appreciate and love the actual original game. That's it for now ladies and gentlemen, thanks for watching, don't forget to subscribe if you like this sort of content, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.